Hello, welcome to our presentation at ASCO 2020. I'm presenting on behalf of Tata Memorial Center. Tata Memorial Center is the oldest and largest academic cancer center in India. I'm also presenting on behalf of the National Cancer Grid, which is a coalition of over 190 cancer centers that was established in India to standardize cancer care. We're presenting the results of a prospective study today of an AI-enabled online intervention. Uh, this intervention was designed to increase delivery of guideline compliant cancer care on the ground. There's no conflict of interest to report in this study. We all know that ensuring that patients on the ground receive guideline compliant care is extremely challenging. There's data about this from around the world. And in fact, uh, one published study from India found that only about 40% of chemotherapy related treatments were guideline compliant. When we look at our data uh, internally from a diverse patient population across India, across economic strata, we found that one third of patients were not receiving guideline compliant care. About half of these were getting what we call over treatment, which is unnecessary treatments that increases costs and side effects and toxicities. And another half were getting under treatment. These are suboptimal treatments that are not gonna get them the right outcomes uh, because these are not compliant with the guidelines. And if you think about it for a country like India, which has about 1 million new cancer patients every year and doesn't have a high affordability for wastage in healthcare spending, this is a staggering number. We just cannot afford in a country like India to be spending on overtreatment and undertreatment and losing lives at this scale. So to fight this and to standardize care across the country, Tata Memorial Center and the NCG established a service uh, called Navia, which is an AI-based online intervention since 2015. In the service, a patient's data is matched to evidence and guidelines, and the treatment plan is vetted by experts and returned to the patient within 24 hours, which is an unheard of turnaround time for a tumor board review. So for this study, we prospectively followed 1,707 patients in the last six months who received a Navia treatment plan based on guidelines and expert review. We prospectively collected their intended treatment plan and we compared it to the NCG and the NCCN guidelines for compliance. We then had a phone follow-up and assessed whether patients with discordant treatment plans changed to the Navia treatment plan. When we followed the discordant patients, we found that 50% of them changed their treatment plan to follow TMC and CG Navia. This change in about half of the discordant population resulted in a 15% increase in online, sorry, in on the ground guidelines compliance. It's from 71% to about 86%. And if you think about it, this percentage increase in compliance is likely going to be higher when you extrapolate it to a countrywide scale. Our patient population is requesting a second opinion. And even though they come from around the country, from different economic backgrounds, they are likely more educated and more informed and are getting treatments at cancer centers because by the very fact that they're requesting a second opinion. If you consider how these results might translate to a healthcare service like Ayushman Bharat, uh, we might be able to see the impact more clearly. Ayushman Bharat is the world's largest healthcare treatment plan and it approves about 300,000 cancer treatments for low income patients in small and rural hospitals across India. And the National Cancer Grid has partnered with Ayushman Bharat to standardize cancer care across India. Even with a 15% improvement, an online intervention like Navya would directly impact about 45,000 cancer treatment plans and standardize them with the NCG guidelines. And in practice in this population, that percent increase in compliance might be substantially more. Overall, an AI-based online intervention like Navia already comes with significant advantages in that it can be cheap, it can be timely, it can be quick, and it can be widely scaled to, to India and countries across the world. And we are all in cancer research trying to discover new treatments and cancer moonshots, but we also know that known treatments are not being delivered at scale. And while moonshots are important, Earth shots like Navia can be implemented and improve outcomes for tens of thousands of cancer patients immediately. Definitely something to think about. Thank you for your time.